There's the reveal. We gotta be inside the Jeep because uh, it's really, really windy. Probably 40 mile per hour winds. But uh, yeah, this is it. Oops, let's back you up a little. You guys already saw the dash. We have the CB, anti-theft in the back. You already saw that. Enough for four people comfortably. I can do mounted travel montages from the Jeep. And you'll, you'll be seeing that from now on. So maybe we'll get some accessories and put them on the hood. I don't know. We'll see. But yeah, we'll, uh, we'll get this Jeep to uh, my specifications that I want. And uh, we'll add some things to it. We'll change, uh, we'll get some better axles and uh, better drive shafts. Get an extra set of tires for it. It's going to cost a lot of money. <laughs> so um, over the next year, I'm going to be doing a build series on the Jeep. Uh, try, I'll try to get one out once a month. We're going to start with some little stuff that uh, that needs to be fixed and uh, I'm going to flip you around so you guys can see one. You see the cracks. You can see the cracks in the window right there. And there's a little chip right there. So there's a couple things that I have to fix. No big deal, it's what happens when you buy a used vehicle. And with this Jeep, I'm going to be able to eliminate a very, very costly expense. And that's, uh, it's a hotel expense, which is like $600 when I go out. Because I like nice hotels. <laughs> I like breakfast in the morning and fresh coffee and stuff like that. Kind of spoiled, but that's okay. We're going to eliminate that $600 or so of hotel expenses, and we'll do this. We'll have the Jeep now. We can stay longer, we can go further, and we can go to places in the past that we have had to abandon because of the vehicles that I previously had access to. My Subaru and the Trailblazer. Well, I still have the Subaru. Now I have a Jeep. So we can go to cool spots now, guys. Super excited about this. This is definitely gonna be a fun journey for you and I. Um, I'm going to put awnings on this. The awnings will probably come off of this side, um, be all the way out, extend out, and most likely going to have it come out the back and just have a cargo rack. That's kind of what I'm thinking. Um, that way it's just easy access right out the back. I don't have to climb up. Um, I'm not getting too old for that. I just don't want to. I don't know. I'm thinking about it. Let me know what you guys think. So I'm really excited about this right here. This is a Midland um, uh, CB radio. You can hear truckers on it, and you can change all the channels that you want. Uh, channel 9, I believe, is uh, still for emergencies. And in the back, I have the, um, the antenna. The dealership took it off, and so it wouldn't get stolen, and they put a, uh, a bolt in there. So I have to take that out. That'll be part of the build series. And, um, I think I turned this off and I should be wearing them. This is no, whatever. Anyways, I'm going to buy handheld, uh, two way radios that are by Midland. They're about 80 bucks. And, um, I'll have those on, on my pack and I'll keep those in here. And then I can use this as a relay, hopefully. And we can go further distances if I bring a, uh, a travel partner with me. Um, we'll have uh, two-way radios um, when we go off into the wilderness. And, uh, yeah, we'll have access to um, an emergency in, in emergency situations. So this is definitely awesome to have. And down here, there's a, uh, a brake assist. You can see that it came on right there when I put my foot on the brake. 
So that's a good thing. Thinking about getting a small little utility trailer um, for work. Um, that's a whole other different story. So, And with that being said, guys, I'm almost being able to be monetized. I need your help, though. I need you guys to go, go all the way back and watch my videos. I have 557 of them, I think. Um, just use my video my video list as your playlist and just go through them all and, and put them in the background and let them just let them play I'm about 1300 hours away from being monetized and um, when I do get monetized I am going to drop my merchandise I have you guys have seen one t-shirt but I'm gonna have hats and hoodies and uh, a couple other things like uh, like some mugs with the carabiner handle um, kind of goes with the theme of the channel and um, yeah just go to my videos dude and watch them please I would love to be monetized so I can get you guys some merchandise and uh, everything will be turned right back around and, uh, to help the channel and to help the build series of the Jeep um, I don't know if I want to name the Jeep because I just am not that type of person but if you guys want to name the Jeep Let's get on a couple adventures first and then we'll, we'll name them. This is the big reveal video. Department of Wildlife just drove by. What's up, guys? I'm on private property. This is my family ranch. So, <laughs> uh, yeah, go to my videos and watch them, guys. Help me get monetized. That way we can get you guys some sweet merch. All right, guys, thanks for coming. I greatly appreciate you. Please. Watch all my videos so we can help do the build on this bad boy. It's gonna cost a little bit of money, but with your guys' help watching the videos, we can get monetized. But thanks for coming, and I hope to see you guys on future builds of this. So this is gonna be the first of many, many um, for the channel. So this is the new channel Jeep. I hope you guys like it if you wanna name it. You can name it. I'm not gonna name it. I don't know if I'll call it that. I don't know. But I love you guys. Thanks for coming. And you can hear the wind. And I'm working on getting some new mics and stuff. The ones with the little fuzzy things on it. So, with that being said, I love you guys. And I'll see you in the mountains.